Welcome back, everyone. It is a beautiful August day. Warm today. I have gone ahead and um, basically cut out this field, cultivated it, um, and now I'm reseeding it with grass. I've decided to not um, not put in trees. Originally I was planning to replant the trees I took out. Changed my mind. We're just going to do a grass field. You know, I was more worried about the the aesthetics of the area, but we need we need maximum field uh, um, output, I guess, in the short term. So we're just going to put some grass right back in here, just by um, cultivating the grass. I've already got my first um, amount of fertilizer. And we got a lot of stuff to do in this episode. I'm going to set a worker on this, I think. That'll work. Yeah, let's do that. Really starting to feel like I need a second tractor now, though. Okay. We'll let our worker take care of that. We'll head back. See you back at the farm. So while I'm walking back here, again, in a really beautiful day, um, I want to say welcome, I guess. Uh, I don't know exactly what I'm doing, but... Um, my sub count has jumped quite dramatically lately, and I'm very happy about it, although I'm not quite sure I understand it. That said, um, welcome to the channel, everybody that's just joining in. Um, started back last August, I guess it was, and, uh, had, uh, want to see a kind of a loyal following, a few people that I know that have been around for since the beginning. Um, been fantastic for supporting me, but that was a whole bunch of new people. So welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really, it really means a lot to me. Um, it's not a, it's not a, you know, size matters kind of thing. It's more of just encouragement for me. And, and it's nice to know that some people are enjoying my, my, uh, videos. So thank you. Okay, so that said, I have just gone and walked by our field. Um, our oats are ready and our grass is ready. So we've got some work to do. I got to get out that old clunker um, and see what we can do with that thing. I really would like to get something new. Maybe I should, um, maybe I should sell this. You know what? I don't know if I can put up with this thing for another harvest. Let me just let me just actually go make a call. I just want to see if there's any options. Um, I'll be right back. Okay, just got off the phone with the dealership. So um, they're willing to take this back. Uh, that said, um, they have some other harvesters available. I, I, I definitely need a harvester, but they really don't have much that I can um, purchase outright. So I think I'm going to lease a harvester. Because this thing is... It's rough. It's slow. It doesn't turn um, very well. I think I need to move on. I think it's time to move on. So... Um, yeah, I am going to go give it a wash, quick wash, and then take it over to the store and uh, see what they want to give me for it. And uh, they've given me a couple of different options. 
uh, for stuff that I could possibly lease. So we'll see. We'll see. Let's let's do that first. Pretty dirty. See if we can make it nice and shiny and get an extra few bucks for it. Da -da -da. Okay. Let's um let's head back to the store. Okay, here we are. Okay, let's see what they give us. Where's the trigger on this thing? Okay, here we are. Uh, we get 10,000 for it. Actually, that's not that bad when you think about it. Yep, yeah, got it right over 10,000. Goodbye. Okay, so let's see what we can do. We'll have to figure something out. We got 21,000. Okay, we're going to get a little fancy here. Um, I'm going to go a little modern. And let's get our, let's lease this. There's 75,000 to buy. There's no way I don't have close to that much money, but lease is uh, 38.25. And um, it's 750 per day and this much per work hour now i am not going to put hours on this thing so it's really not going to be that much uh in the long run of course i still have to get a header for this though so we got that and we'll get the proper header that'll be on a lease as well uh 250 per day 525 per hour so We'll try to be very efficient with it. That is much, much better. Huge upgrade. Oh, upgrade. I don't own it. Good news is I have more money in my pocket now. It is comparable speed, land speed, but I think it harvests faster. And we will need our beacon for sure. Alright, let's head back. Let's see you guys there. Alright, we are back. And we may as well put this to work right away. Let's turn off that beacon. We don't need it here. There we go. Our swath. Yeah, this feels a lot better. A lot better. This is actually one of my favorite um, harvesters in the game. Used it a ton in FS19. I use it. A, uh, I used it a bit in 22. I don't know. There's just something about it that I like. We're going to get our headland done. We'll be doing 16% so far. We'll get our headland done. We'll get a worker on this. And I believe um, we are finished with the uh, drilling in the grass, the new grass. So we'll be able to... Um, we'll be able to get some other work done. Okay, we've got a worker set on this. 
I'll let them go, see how, how they do. Let's jump over to our other tractor and uh, we'll come back up. We've got some working up top to do here. Uh-oh. I might be in trouble. For some reason, I seem to have drilled onto the neighbor's field. Oh, they're not going to be happy with me. Okay. Let's head back. And we've got some grass to mow. Uh, and we have a lot of, well, grass to pick up. As well as some... As well as some straw to pick up. And I am now feeling like I want to go back to bales. So we might do that. Just easier to store. Um, I don't really have anywhere to store this stuff. And I do want to keep some of it. So... I will need some of the grass for hay. Yeah, we'll see. Oh, I can't get through that way. Let us go over here. Yeah, sorry, I got a, I interrupted myself. I, I guess I squirreled. Um, I do need to go and check on those greenhouses. Um, I've, I kind of almost forgot that I have those. So we we'll need to go down there and see what's going on. We might have some product there to sell. Okay. We're going to need this a little bit later to redrill that field, but we'll deal with it then. Uh, what's next? What's next? What should I do? I think I want to... So much to do. Um, I think I want to, to uh, mow. That would be my next step. No, wait, 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 wait. Before I do that, that harvester is going to require... Where's my trailer? That harvester is going to need emptying, so I'm going to get the trailer reconfigured. I'll bring it over there. We can just leave it there and, and uh, you know, just leave the trailer out there. Uh, customize, I want. Oh, that'll be the other nice thing, too. We can tip, tip properly, or get the auger pipe working properly. Instead of doing that cheesy thing we had to do with the other one. Struggling with words today. Words are difficult. It is actually only at 54 percent so i don't even think we're going to get a full trailer or a full harvester load i guess the capacity on a harvester is much higher it's all good fine fine by me how are you guys doing today all right Let's get this mower. This beautiful, beautiful mower will make this job so fast. As you can see, I did remove that tree. That tree is gone. I did also feed the sheep using the small mower. I, I uh, mowed up some of the grass. You can see I made a kind of a trim around here. This time we won't go so close to the edge. Last time we had troubles picking stuff up there. Oh. Having a hard time backing up. All right. We got this. We got it.
And I think I'm going to go around this way here. Ooh, I was told that uh, this mower would clear out that brush. I guess not. We'll fix that. Not a problem. All right, one last little bit over here. And we just got a bit more over here. Okay, we are mowed. Easy peasy. Love this mower. Okay, let's get this guy put away. We'll put him right there. Alright, just gonna jump over to the harvester for a minute. So we're going to have almost the full full harvester's worth. Not a great time to be selling barley. But that's okay. There. Alright. So. Do we bail? Or do we continue with this? And I feel like I want to start bailing. So... Um, let's, uh, and we'd have to return this, I guess. We could sell this, we won't get much for it, but at least we'll have a storage space. And, yeah, I'm not quite sure. Uh, I want to go down and have a look at the, um, greenhouses, but I want the trailer bring the trailer with me in case there's anything there we can sell. Okay, a few more little bits. We're at 87%. Look at that. As a matter of fact, I could probably put the next extension on there as well. That's fantastic. Okay, we are back. Assuming it will fit right in here, no problem. Nice thing about this harvester, oops. Nice thing about this harvester, I can get a corn header for it too if I need it one day. Okay, tractor. I think we're gonna do that. I think we will, um... Return that and start bailing again. This for now, we can't really sell this. It's probably about the worst price right now. I think we're just gonna put it in our in our silo for now. Really feel like I need more income though. So the best time to sell oats, oats. Um, biggest price here is thirteen fifty nine at Heinrich. Eighteen is quite a difference. This is almost at the bottom. That's what I thought. So, okay, let me reconfigure this. We're gonna go down to the uh, greenhouses and see um, if there's anything there I could sell. Whatever we find there, I will sell it immediately. We've got planned for production, but we don't have that production yet, so... Yeah. Customize self-loading pallets. I don't think it's self-loading bales, though. So that's a whole other thing. Alright, let's head down there. 
I know if I go this way, I can go right there. Alright, do we have anything here? We have nothing. Zilch. Did I activate these properly? They are all activated. Okay, well, I guess so be it. So, failing game. Uh, let's have a look at what we can do. Now, um, see, I want to buy. Um, I could get this. The problem with this is that I can't wrap bales made with this size. So that's a bit of a problem. It's also, you know, not that cheap. The beauty of this is these bales I can actually pick up by hand. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Um, if I was to go to something, where is it? Where are they? Uh, these guys. These guys are heck of a deal. They're square bales, though. I don't really want square. I want round bales. Oh, dear. Maybe I'll be leasing again. Ooh, a nice fast bail. <laughs> that would be cheating. Um, 39,000. 25. All right, so no, no products yet. The greenhouses. I thought for sure I'd have a couple, but that's all right. That's okay. All right, we're on our way back. We've got our oat harvested out of the field. Uh, we still have some work to do. That'll be for next episode. I think we're going to start moving to bales. Uh, I just need to figure out um, a low cost solution, I guess, to getting it done which might involve more leasing, um, but that's okay. We, we can do that. All right, we are back. All right, guys, that'll be it for this episode. Um, lots of work still to do, as you can see. We'll get this all sorted out. We'll have a solution for next next episode. Thank you very much for watching. And uh, if you're enjoying this, please consider subscribing. Thanks again. I hope you have a great day.